People don't believe in misfits. The 6-2 scoreline, not enough. We'll see if the doubters can be proven wrong. I'm not sure where I land. If they beat G2, it's going to be big. With your emoji here and there, because the Stride Breaker. I think he tried to dash with this Stride Breaker and get on to Wunder. <laughs> Wunder's just taunting him now. The Wunder emotes are great. Special. Again, could flash forwards and look for a hook. Wunder's going to spot it out now. Bye, have a great gets time. The dash, uses the e, gets out. A winning jungle matchup, I must say, in the early stages. I mean, Body Bear wins out the 1v1. Caps might have found him, though. Don't worry, it's going to be big. You talked about how stats effective it is. It's going to leap down. Marco taking so much damage. Now they're turning and they're trying to burn. Now it's going to be the one for one so far. Yanko's forced to back away, but overall, Nuke Duck's just going to grab another kill. Dominus health boost. Ooh, Nuke Duck. The chain's going to land. Oh, has the hell no. Stolen ulti coming out. He's going to get hooked from Advi, and he didn't even see him coming. Cap's now going to be in trouble. That's the tower shot ticking, burning, corrupting potion. Is it going to be enough? Nuke Duck falls forward. Advi and going in. Nuke Duck. On a killing spree, but it's now Cryus who's going to be in trouble. That's a kill traded back on the top side for G2 Esports. He's not really finding... And when I think of Caps, I think of him pushing in mid, moving towards side lanes, just diving people level 3. It's not that much of a meta right now, but even in this game, 1-3. Are going to need some of that skirmishing prowess. They've all played together for a long time. That's the advantage that they have, but now Caps is going to be in trouble. He's going to steal the ult, but he can't leap Boom. out. Odin to safety, but he goes over the wall and he just gets followed. If we look at the replay, I think this is the mid dive. So you can see Nuketok just hits the chains. Marcoon, although he was slightly hesitant initially, as soon as the chains land, he just goes for it. Ult's taken away, but he just matches ult to ult. Hello there. Oh, that look, that's beautiful. Oh, man. Oh, oh there he goes no! again! Oh, that replay! Oh, no! <laughs> oh, no! There are way too many bear sky punches in this game. That looks so funny. And he's really, really far ahead. A Fed LeBlanc is very dangerous against the comp of G2. Top lane. They're trading back, he's low on mana. He has Ignite up in a couple of seconds. He might want to turn it when he does. It's up right now, so he might start to walk forwards. <laughs> Nikos is on the way to the dash for us. Give it slash. A bit of healing coming in. Ignite does go down, but Cries will be able to walk Comes that Yanko's one though. off. Yanko's coming up the dark. This is highlighted. There's the control flash board. Kick. Sonic wave. Just the kick. Ooh. Doesn't even need to flash for it. Played a lot longer together. They do not have two rookies on the rift. And Wonder, now potentially caught out here. Big damage going in, though. It's Marcoon who's been caught out. He's unstoppable. Hook lands on the Yanko. This had and walks away. But that's going to be the jungler taken out of the area. Good sidestep for Marcoon. Patrick flashing out to safety. Bull Bear should fall down here as Yanko finds the kill. Who can place Run. Chakram now coming in. Mickey going to be in trouble. The dash forward from Cries. The immediate flash out to safety. Cries going to finish the job there. We'll keep rising on the map states. G2 playing more towards top side. They're going to drop this midway, but they want to make sure they can contest top side vision. Oh, it's clean play, the stun, the follow-up. Caps now needs to leap out to safety. He's unstoppable for now. Flashed over the wall. Oh, Marcoon. Safety, but Marcoon's not done yet, baby! Can he feast him? Can he lock him down? Caps barely making it out. The rest of the team now on the retreat, but the Baron Close. still getting completed. Yankos with the flash, with the kick, with the smite available. Yankos. Q nope. over the wall, goes in, cannot get it. Marcoon taking a Baron away from Yankos in his first game. 30 seconds on these members of G2. Huge wave stacked up. Five members of XL with Baron buffs. I think they're just going to end the game. They're walking down, they're not going to get baited. They will not get pulled around the map. XL, they are here. They turn, they get it. They make this game their own. And in their first matchup, Marcoon and Advian take down G2 Esports. CC again, Yanko's finding Razzlecker in the river here over Crab. Back, Yanko's definitely gonna be in trouble here. Leeson certainly wins out on these duels. Mickey X on the way in, the flash over though. Razzlecker is not done yet. Mickey there, Blastcone gonna save the day. Razzlecker, is he gonna follow? Fiesta in the bot side, in the top side of the map, Vito. Slowed down there by the Solar Flare. He's gonna fully commit here. Dash forward from Cass, that's the Gale Force. Good damage to come through, nothing Vander can do. They got a lot of resource in terms of combat summoners. Kobe, I think he's just dead here. There's no TPs either. No sums. Just gonna back away, but Razzlecker, on the way, so G2 not going to overcommit. Nara's on reference yesterday. Oh, oh, I, yeah. shit. I mean, if it's fits for... Uh, oh, Wonder Mickey. Mickey again going in, though. The knockback is there, but it's too little. Mickey too clean on these ganks. And massive credit to G2. Again, Caps dying once or twice in the early game was big, but Mickey has been chain ganking mid lane, and now Caps is starting to pull ahead. Not someone you want to give any advantages to. Gale Force out safety, getting away from Razor. Oh, Razor, no room to find I'm the dying. kick. Fight. Dash in, Gale Force is there, but he's kicking, and he's going to try to finish the job. He gets knocked back. Reckless saving his I'm mid laner, jump, keeping jump, him alive. The flash forward, I'm one, two, I'm auto. The explosive charge, bye bye. We've seen Anathema's chains on the enemy team. That's going to be difficult to survive. Vander is there to body block, but even he is a very squishy Thunder. cow. There's no more tower there, and he's just going to start to get run down. They finally knock back the Mundo, but G2 there, an unstoppable onslaught. Razork's been caught. Now, what was he even doing there? Waiting off to the side. 
Can they get anything done? 5k, it's getting lower. Razor are gonna need to be a miracle play, but they're just pulling away from the Baron and they're turning for the bite instead. Wonder on the front line, Caps laying down the coaling. Vander just getting shredded through. That's the Ignite ticking. Dash forward on the Gale for Solar Flare. It's here in the midst of the back line, but here it can't get anything done. Pulls forward, he's gonna dunk him down back over the wall. He wants to turn it back. Here it wants to get something done, but he does not have the necessary damage. Razor manages to land the kick, the kickback. Razor manages to find a kill, but it's just not enough. Reckless, Wonder, Mickey, Caps, everybody is still up except for Yankos. This positioning could from Vander could be massive. G2, burn it. both of their carries are right next to each other. If Misfits burn it without any, giving up any major cooldowns, maybe they can turn and burn. Maybe they can win the fight. Misfits have the Elder. Is that Vander? going to be enough? Vander off on the flank. The rest of Misfits can now fully commit. The colon comes out. Vander might just get immediately taken down. Mickey's still in the midst of the entire team. Yankos off to the side. Eyes on Yankos, but the knockback is there. Yankos Ooh. getting burned down by the Elder Dragon buff. Misfits, they're making it work. Caps on the run. Kabe in the back line. Ooh. Elder Dragon doing work. Burned down one by one. Misfits were 10k down, but the Elder Dragon wins them the fight. But when it mattered most, when the pressure was on, Misfits saw their window of opportunity. Misfits want to fight for first. They are poised to end. It is Reckless versus the world. They have to go for it. They just have to commit Reckless to have Elder Dragon. 10 seconds on Yanko. Mickey's up soon. I think they're just going to win. Misfits make a miracle happen to bring the game back and to hold on to first place in the LEC. Most of that game was not a Misfits game to win. Most of that game was G2 dominating, but a single play defines a game. It's a, it's a crazy thing to watch. That's, that was nuts. That's the power of Elder Dragon, I suppose. If you told me a 10k gold lead or Elder, I'd pick 10k gold lead every time. And apparently, sometimes I would be wrong.